Reuters, Intel Corp, INTCO, on Thursday gave a bullish forecast and blew past Wall Street expectations for the fourth quarter on the strength of data center sales, the business it sees as key to its transformation from a PC supplier. Intel stock rose 3.8% to $47.06, boosted by a 10% dividend hike and the forecast, which signaled that Intel is succeeding in containing fallout from recently disclosed security flaws that could allow hackers to steal data from computers. Those flaws, dubbed Spectre and Meltdown, created global concern among technology users, and Intel acknowledged on Thursday, for the first time, that the fallout could hurt future results. But Intel executives consistently indicated that they did not expect that to happen. Software fixes for the problems would be succeeded by solutions designed into Intel chips themselves later this year, Chief Executive Brian Krasanek said on a conference call. In an interview ahead of Intel Euro Trademark S earnings call with investors, Chief Financial Officer Bob Swan said the company sees no a euro e meaningful impact a euro on corporate earnings from the vulnerabilities. A euro or FA had all these bullets flying at them with these chip flaws, but when I look at these numbers, eat a euro trademark as a blowout across all metrics a euro said Daniel Morgan, a fund manager with Sinovus Trust, which holds Intel shares. A euro or F that makes it a bulletproof quarter a euro. Revenue from the company Euro Trademark S higher margin data center business rose about 20% to $5.58 billion, beating the average analyst estimate of $5.13 billion, according to Thomson Reuters I slash B slash E slash S investors had targeted 10% growth, said Kevin Cassidy, an analyst at Stifel. A Euro data center group is one of the key metrics we are watching. Eta Euro trademark S certainly a positive to see that turn up a Euro said Peter Carazaris, an analyst Intel investor Thrivent Financial. Revenue from Intel a Euro trademark SPC group hit $9 billion for the quarter, a 2% decline from the year before, but ticked up 3% for the year to $34 billion. Intel also saw strong growth in two small non-PC businesses that it hopes to expand in the future. Its so-called Internet of Things business, which focuses on connecting streetlights and industrial machines to the web, expanded 21% to $879 million for the quarter. Programmable chips, which customers like Microsoft Corp., MSFTO, are experimenting with using in data centers, grew 35% to $568 million for the quarter. Intel predicted $65 billion in revenue for 2018, well above expectations of a $63.7 billion forecast. The company also said its tax rate would be 14% for 2018 after changes in U.S. tax law that its executives said created a a euro level playing field a euro for U.S. manufacturers. Intel warned in its earnings release that fallout from the discovery of Spectre and Meltdown could hurt future results as well as customer relationships and the company Euro trademark S reputation. Analysts have said the biggest risk to Intel might come from customers using the disruption caused by fixing the bug as an excuse to press for lower prices. The company posted a loss of $687 million, or 15 cents per share, in the fourth quarter ended December 30th, including a $5.4 billion charge related to recent changes in U.S. tax law. Excluding items, the chip maker earned $1.08 per share for the fourth quarter, up 39% from $0.79 cents a year earlier. Total revenue for the quarter rose 4.1% to $17.1 billion, up from $16.4 billion a year earlier. Those figures beat analysts a euro trademark expectations of a profit of $0.86 cents per share on a revenue of $16.34 billion, according to Thomson Reuters I slash B slash E slash S.